Hey guys, this is Girl Got Game. And PC Outcast. And we're jamming to the music before the frustration of getting this tiny tot her unbirthday gift sets in. <laughs> yeah, every time I hear this, this stuff, I'm like, it's The Sims! <laughs> <laughs> so last time we dressed up, Critter got her some perfume, which mm -hmm. we thought was our present, and didn't realize we had to get two presents. Now we gotta find another present. And we're Cheeky. gonna figure out how to do that. So I'm suggesting we go talk to most people. Okay. And see like, what happens. Like her. Yeah. Maybe maybe Lady Van Buren has an idea. Yeah. You mothered this spawn. Lady Van Buren. Yes. Yes. Are you sure? And you're sure the elf's here? Of course! She flew here from Seastone on a magic hippogriff. We followed her trail to here, and there are no indications that the hippogriff has flown on. Then I may take my leave, Lady Van Buren? Yes, yes. Okay. Uh, that's true. The hippogriff did not fly away, no. away from here. How is she tracking the hippogriff? Oh, well, because it's it's been converted by... Yeah, we yeah. don't actually know what it looked like before. Right. We're probably going to be like, holy crap, look at it's that. It's so-and-so. Uh, should we go talk to him? Sure. He's, <clears throat> he's a good presence guy. Right. Um, hello? Hi. How's it gone? Uh -huh. Okay, it's just the hour deal still stands. I've got to go. See you later. See you later. Can I talk to you about it? Um, I think that's just speak on behalf of the parrot. Oh, okay. Uh, we can try the oracle of a thousand mirrors. I'm trying to figure out if we need to like bring the hippogriff back. Hmm. Maybe. Uh oh. Oh, he's underwater. Shush, this is a really good bit. Okay, so he's busy. Can we take the mirror of happy children as a present? Some happy children playing in a garden. Ivo's mother refuses to believe that Ivo's children could have a happy future too. Who cares if the future queen has an illegitimate okay, child? Okay, so it's the same stuff well, from last time. apart from me. Okay. Uh, I guess back to the ship. Sorry, Critter. We'll be back, bro. Enjoy your tea. Oh, oh, he. What? How did you transport? Okay, never mind. Uh. Hey, critter. Hey, critter. Huh? You look great. It's okay. <laughs> Forget it. I've got everything under control. <laughs> go, go, look. Uh, the hippogriff. You can only look at it. Okay. Does the hippogriff want some ancient seeds to eat? Most of the communication between a captain and his ship. Okay. The hippogriff's still hungry. I know that much. Try some nasty old seeds? Yeah. You never know. Nope. nope. Okay, my other thought is to go back to the elf burrow and use the phone with mom? Away we I think go. I tried that. But we only got the cell phone last episode. Oh, the actual cell phone. Yeah, because we got magic. Cast right. off. Cast off. Oh, I forgot that we could actually use um, the this thing, the map in our, oh, in that our inventory. Too. Yeah, we have quite a few options. Anyway, um, off we go. Go. Get go, out. Hey, Get go. out of there. All right, to Ivo's room. And if not, Dad's very wise. Maybe he knows about unbirthday presents. Does you want a sword? <laughs> the perfect gift for a small child. <laughs> The Buster Sword, perfect. Okay, never mind. Hi, girls. Oh. What? What? How about what? 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 Hey, why didn't? Why wouldn't he take that before? <sighs> okay, so now we can actually show. Yes. Can we? 
I can't remember what we, I thought we could use that to show for the Oracle anyway to show Lady Van Buren that she's here. We were trying that, but it was only our own personal mirror. But now we've taken the mirror that lets us actually look at her. So I don't know how. Can we switch the mirror out? Can we? Yeah. Can we use that one uh, where the old mirror was? No. Okay. So we have a. What does he have to say about? This mirror and the one from the observatory have a special connection. Okay. So it's like we have kind of a. A cell, not not a cell. It's like the same principle as a cell phone, but it's you can see into a place that you wouldn't be able to see. Like a television. It's like a like a closed circuit, uh, closed circuit TV. I think, yeah, I guess. I was sort thinking of. like binoculars. Although it's back and it's two way. Yeah. I guess it's FaceTime then. Ha uh ha. -huh. <laughs> okay, so well, we got a mirror. Uh, it wasn't quite what I was expecting to get no. down here. Okay, so no to the cell phone. No um, to the cell phone. I guess, should we go try talking to Dad? I can't believe he took the mirror now. Hey, Dad. I mean, Bob. Help. Bob. Enlighten me, Bob. You know the way. Hey, Bob. Bob needs his sleep. Uh, I'm only okay. supposed Okay, and there's nothing else we can look at in here, right? We looked at... Looked at everything, okay. All right. Well, I guess we can use the postcard. We don't have to... Move. Move. How far over here can you go? Okay. That's as far as we can go. Okay, what's the other... Uh... Oh, it's Egypt we can go. <clears throat> well, not Egypt, but... Uh... What's it called? Oops. Ipsum? Lorem Ipsum. Oopsum. Cast off. <laughs> I oopsed them <laughs> when I tried to pronounce it. <laughs> okay, so Critter's just like hanging out as that now. Very nice. Might as well. Apparently that does some really, really sticky uh, powder. White powder. White powder, right. Mm -hmm. Okay, can we use a two-way mirror in here somewhere? Do we have to give one of the mirrors to Critter? Like, give Critter the... No? How about the other one? No? Hmm. Can we give him the phone? No? Is this the way you transfer? So I think so. Like, try the block of wood, because we've done that before. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. okay. So it will actually show. Yeah. Oh, we can give him the seeds. Hmm. Hmm. We can give him the powder. We can give him a good powdering. We've got that on. Oh, oh give we... him a powdering. Got yeah. it. Gotcha. Oh, that's a thing. I don't think we can use that. Oh, we can give the flagstone to him, too. Hmm. Yeah, I'm... Critter also has a chisel. Critter has a chisel and we have a hammer. What can you do with a hammer and chisel? And give him the hammer? hammer? Okay. Sure. Why not? Oh. Nate, why are you underwater? Nate! I don't know How you doing, Randolph? Something we can do under mm -hmm. here? In here? Okay. Oh, we have... Okay, we could try using the hammer and chisel on that. Nope. Hammer? Nope. Maybe Nate has to do it because he's stronger? There's a couple of holes. Let's look at no. the little hole. No. No. Hmm. We can run, but that doesn't... Doesn't seem to do anything. <sighs> and then there's the rock. The rock? Yeah, like outside. There's the boulder by the pit of sadness. And by pit of sadness, I mean death and scare of beetles. Is there anything else to interact with? There's the... Press. Oh, over there. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. Gotcha. 
smash it with a hammer. Ah, <sighs> okay. How about? There you go. Thank you. There you go. Thank you. Can you? No. Can you go over here? Nope. There's a panel on the wall as well. This part of the column shoots out if you trigger a mechanism in the floor. Are you sure? Yeah. Yes, I am. I would jump over, but I don't know if there's another trap on the other side of the slab. Um. Can I use this? Oh. Jam the piece of wall in. Sure. Perfect. Oh. One trap less. Hooray. Okay. What's next? The ball must weigh tons. Isn't there another way into the burial chamber? Burial chamber? Uh, I've somehow got to move it. You got to move it. <laughs> Smash it with the hammer. Um... Read an ancient tombstone thing to it. <laughs> Talk to it. Talk. Powder it. Throw old seeds on it. Show it, Ivo. We can't. We took away the All right. power. Whoops. Okay, none of that stuff works um, on it. Um. Can is critter strong enough to do anything with the boulder? I don't think so. But who knows? Maybe it's the flat. Yeah. And? and? Do you want to do something with that? You can Maybe. take the chisel. Maybe don't do that. No. Mm -hmm. Got any ideas? Uh, nope. I'm at that time again where yeah. I'm like, I don't know what to do. <sighs> like, no one wants to go in there. There's no way to reflect light in there. I mean, every time it's like. Perhaps I can lever the door open with a plank. No, not a chance. Why not? What do you know about it? Aside from the fact that I helped to build this pyramid? Hmm, that's an argument. Yeah, but maybe we try anyway, huh? What do you think about that, buddy Opalo? Oops. He took off his stuff. He did. He wasn't gonna look silly like a uh, critter. Hey, critter, got any ideas? Hey, critter. Huh? You crit. Forget it. I've got everything under control. I feel like you don't have everything under control, Nate. No. Nothing's moving anymore. The tip of the chisel's jammed between the floor and the piece of column. Yeah. Nothing's moving anymore. There are some nasty looking spikes waiting at the bottom of the pitfall, and some scarab beetles are scurrying around between them. I would suggest that we don't fall into that pit, then. Yeah, thank. Hmm. Sorry, I'm just looking. If you figure it out in the meantime, though. <laughs> I met Critter in the Northlands. Nice people up there. 
Penguins mainly. <laughs> hmm. Can I? Oh, I can't actually talk to um, Mortimer's uh, mummy. <laughs> Mortimer's mummy. Okay, so we need the parrot. We need the parrot. We need the parrot. All we can do is, do, do is talk to him, though. We have to use the Cast cell off. phone on uh, the statue? It's a statue. Yeah. Statue. The statue to the left? Not the right, not the middle. The statue to the left. Use the cell phone on that. Don't ask me why. Ah! Give me the compass, bird brain! Did you say that? Huh? I'm over here. Be careful what you say, William. What? William's dead. I'm talking to you. <laughs> William's I'm... dead. What? I've had enough of you and this whole charade. Give Nate what he needs and let me go. Ah. You ungrateful tit. I told you, you're only to speak when I ask you something. What? No one listens to you, fatty. What? Fatty? What? I won't be insulted by a feathered mongrel. One more word. And what, bird brain? Ah. Oh, just you wait. No, come back, come back. Who's gonna talk to me now? I saw the monkey. I'm gonna just take my phone. <laughs> so stealthy. Yeah, I'm sure he doesn't notice at all. Uh... Okay, um, so I think we go out now to collect the parrot. Is he gonna give me the compost now or no? We have to get rid of the. Van I only Buren's have to first. get rid of the Van Buren's, then I. Oh, okay. Da 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 Okay. You wanna come down here, buddy? Hey there, little fella. Come down here. Mm -hmm. Oh, we have seeds. I think the pair. Hey. That's what hey, you up for. there. Are you hungry? You want some dead <laughs> seeds? Gotcha. What is just grabbed it by the neck? <laughs> and now I put you in my pocket. Oh my. And present pirate's parrot. <laughs> I'm lucky the bird is more of an accessory and isn't a fighter like the ape. All right, now we can put on our outfit again. <sighs> but I heard fairy tale and girly things. I did not think a rude parrot. Hi. Oh, Hatter, have you got a present for me? I got a really pretty bird. Look, I've got a pretty bird. Oh, that really is pretty. Pretty squaw. And he talks. Ooh. <laughs> oh, that's such a lovely present. Please, Mr. Bird, do take a seat. Never would have guessed the bird. And you may sit down over there, Mr. Hatter. Quickly. But of course, my lady. And isn't your mother going to be joining us? Uh-huh. Mommy, it's tea time! The Hatter and the Rabbit are here! So what? It's lovely that you found someone to play with, but Mummy has to work. You promised me the biggest and bestest present ever as soon as the Hatter and the Rabbit arrived! But darling, those aren't... <laughs> I want my present! 
prison now! Oh my goodness. Where is it? Daddy, but darling, I want it we now. already talked about this. You mustn't get so overexcited and stop pointing that thing at me. I want my present! Oh my God. Uh, of course, of course. It's uh, in sea stone. Well, you, you can choose something from the shop. I can't do anything here by the look of it. So she can use magic too, or what was that? Yeah, she seems to have a magic wand as well. Huh. Weird. Oi. Huh. Are we free? Oh, we can take candy. Oh, uh, uh. oh the candy. Blah. Go back out there, you bum. There's a bear. Oh, my. Candy. Oh, man. Critter, like, pieced out of there wow. as quickly as you can. Mmm. Delicious. It's impossible to keep your hands off this kind of thing. Don't Augustus gloop yourself, please. Mmm. I'm... Not proud. <laughs> uh huh. All right, we got food for the hippogriff. All right, compass time. Hopefully, he's gonna betray us, of course. Yeah, I thought the the cell phone was gonna be when he inevitably betrayed us. We were gonna have to pretend to be the the parrot to get him to give us the thing. All right, buddy. Maybe we can still uh, move the statue bit by bit. Bit by little bit. Good news. Have they gone? They have? Certainly. It was hard work, but worth it for a magic compass. What magic compass? The spirit compass you promised me. I don't remember that. Do you, Pierre? Nah, Pierre doesn't either. You said you'd lend me the spirit compass if I got rid of the Van Burens. So what? Did you hear me say? Pirate's word of honor. You... Uh, <laughs> you didn't say pirate's word of honor. Therefore, according to pirate law, no contract was entered into. You should have known that, mate. But I need the compass. <laughs> oh my. And I'm not going to hand it over that easily. You should have known that, too. Out with him and bolt the door. <laughs> Oh. You're Nothing gonna regret rolls. this. What did you say, Pierre? Fat loony? I wouldn't dare say that. <laughs> okay. So now we can't do anything in there. Okay. Sadly. He's like escorted us out. Hey, Look at the guard. No, you know you, you wanna. Huh. That thug bolted the gate <laughs> after he threw me out. Okay. That's... Great. Now what? Um, I guess we go back to the ship. And give this sweet thing some candy. Here you go. Would you like some of these sweets? Whoa, Betty! Oh, holy Someone's got one hell of a sweet tooth. The, I haven't got wagon. any more. Huh? Nah. That's up. There's about 200 weights of these unhealthy treats waiting for you over there, in front of the palace. Huh? Yeah. Yes, go, but make sure you don't eat them all at once. Otherwise, you two will not be proud. Okay, now let's go. Where? Off the ship. Follow that thing. Follow that hippogriff. Too sweet. There she is. He is. What have you done, little fella? Ah. Oh no. The whole lot? How was that even. I mean, it's gotta have gone somewhere. Oh my. Uh -oh. Are you okay? Ah. <laughs> what did I just witness? Uh -oh. Look at the dung heap. I don't want to. That's wanna. the biggest, most formidable, <laughs> and most glittery heap of dung I've ever seen. Yes, take it. Too good handful. That's. Uh, 
Ah, uh, it's still warm. Um. Not only is she blessed with an appetite, she's also got fantastic <laughs> digestion. <laughs> ah! <laughs> well, she sounds okay. Can I eat more treats? No, though? I'm gonna be strong. For now. I thought it, she, yeah. ate, she ate like everything. All right. This hippogriff dung in my bag is some of the most repulsive and stinky stuff I've ever carried around. And that includes the night I carried Stinky Pete home from the tavern. Okay. What do we need? You <laughs> throw at the monkey. <laughs> um. What could we use that with? I'm just getting, I just become more and more lost the longer we play this game. <laughs> I mean, fair. Uh, Two handfuls of hippo dung. Like, what can we. Yeah, I'm trying to think, like, what that could be used for. Like, what if we come across. That needs some pink poo on it. <laughs> yes, that. <laughs> um We still have the shriveled seeds, too. Can we plant the seeds in the pink dung? <laughs> no. That was a good idea though. <laughs> They'd probably grow into like Jack's beanstalk. Oh my god. Climb out of this game. <laughs> Oh, one thing I didn't think about is hammering this. No. Oh. Um. Uh, I have no idea. Like I've, I've li okay. I literally right. have no idea. Uh, I'll, I'll look again just because my brain. I mean, I can go talk to the oracle while you're looking that up. Sure. See if he has any thoughts nice. about the. What's going on? Oh. Why did you take Ivo's mirror? Oh, good call. Let's oh. give them a bit of privacy. What do you think? Private what? <laughs> Private what? You, you what? Oh. Oh, that was a very short-lived temper tantrum. Perhaps you could help me again? Shush, this is a really good bit. Okay, but we do need to use Ivo's mirror in front of the mirror with the children. That one. Oh, right. Hey, I was watching that! It won't take long. Anyway, you owe me a favor for getting rid of the Van Burens. Ah, uh, all right then. But hurry up! So now we have okay. to try and give this mirror to, uh, Diva's mom so she can see the happy children. Yeah, I guess. I guess yeah. Right? yeah. Oh, I see. I see Is what they're going for. Only the best captains are already in the right place before they set off. Oops. <laughs> Wrong. Uh, uh. Cast off. I see, I see, okay. Yeah, they're going for the let's annoy the living crap out of everybody uh, that plays this game uh, shtick. <laughs> I'm not annoyed. I'm fine. Mm, that's I'm because happy. Because you're a completionist. Are completionists naturally happy people? <sighs> if this doesn't work, then I'm a goner. Well, don't least... hurt me. You have to see this. You. Wait, 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 wait. You did this to my baby. Look. I didn't. And you should have a look at this. Your grandchild. <laughs> Stop making such a rocket. Nora, keep those kids of yours in check. Nora? Um, well. You want to see into the future and find out what you've done to her? I'll show you. Why don't you ask Granny whether she'll tell you a story? Don't call me Granny. A story, a story! Do you really want to keep her imprisoned here so that she hates you for the rest of her life? Granny tells the best stories! All right then, what story do you want to hear? No. I see I was wrong. He's gonna have a daughter. I made a decision for Ivo once because I thought it was the best for her. It broke my heart, and it was wrong. 
Only one person should make decisions on Ivo's life. Ivo. I'll wait outside. With my hat and my bow tie. <laughs> but fine. Mom? <laughs> What's happened? You stunned me! Sorry. Not quite so fast, darling. How much time has passed? A little. The human is still here. He's waiting outside. Oh, it's me. Uh, is Nate still here? Is Nate still here? He convinced me to wake you up. Ivo. I didn't want this. One can be full of good intentions and still do the wrong thing. And apologies will not make what's done undone. No, they don't. But one can only try to do the right thing and hope to be forgiven. Ivo. Hmm. See you later. See you later, Mother. That means I'll be back instead of like, so like well. so long. I'm out of here, never coming back. I fetched this. Are you okay? Do you yes, like our outfits? Fine. <laughs> Dad yeah, says I have beautiful. you to thank for this. I didn't want to just leave you lying there. And while I was at it, I discovered Laura Ipsum. Then you'll help me transform Alistair back. What do you mean, help you? The critter and me did all the work while you were asleep. <laughs> Oh, you. Oh. Oh, easy. We'll, we'll bring Alistair back. That's all. It changes nothing, all right? I don't want anything else. Now let's get out of Meanwhile, here. Meanwhile, Critter's like, Get oh some distance God. between me and my mother. You heard, Critter. Cast off. <laughs> now we just gotta get awoken. We just gotta get her uh, pirate outfit back on, and we'll be in great gaggle <laughs> A trio. Uh, right I guess right. Laura Mipson. Cast off. Now that we got the brains of the outfit back, we should be able to solve this mystery. <laughs> Ivo? Yes? <laughs> see you later down below. See you later. Okay, see ya. Uh, bye. You know that your hippogriff like pooped out a giant Impressive. turd? Did you excavate all this? Yeah. We had some help. Who? Oh, you're never He's gonna guess. He's waiting in the pyramid, the entrance of which me and Critter opened all on our own. Poodle-loop. Poodle -loop. Should we switch to her so she can look at everything? So you can do all the uh, dialogue? Yeah. Stop calling me out on being a completionist. I just want to know what she has to say. A hastily repaired sundial. The pointer will be completely useless in a few months' time. We won't need it in a few months' time. Thousands of years and that obelisk is still standing. Impressive. Mm -hmm. Very. A hastily re Okay. Uh, there's a sarcophagus. Strange. Why is there a sarcophagus out here in the open? Does it look and familiar? And somehow it seems very familiar to me. Yeah. Strange. And s Okay, in we go. May I introduce you to... Uh, the mummy. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Mortimer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I am not going to talk to you. You know each other? Well, we know each other. I don't know what it's doing here, but for the sake of my sanity, I'm going to ignore it. You really do know each other. What's wrong with her? No, nothing. She just misses Mortimer. All right, Ivo, you can look at things. Maybe you're strong enough to jimmy the door. In former times, this pyramid was probably teeming with slaves. Today, even a pregnant princess has to open every door herself. <laughs> Ouch. Okay. Informat- Can't get good help these days. A bronze chisel has been wedged under this piece of column, presumably to keep it in place. Yes. A bronze- Okay. 
Surprising. Even the things made of wood are still preserved. Well, I guess the climate's warm and dry in here, but I would have expected that much more would have rotted away after all this time. Are you scared of the dark? Can you see in the dark? Even my elf eyes aren't able to penetrate this darkness. Okay. I don't dare enter without light. Everyone's scared of the dark here. Even my elf eyes aren't able- I okay. don't dare enter- Can we give her the wood? Because she's stronger than Nate and Critter. Okay. Right. Okay, Nate. Give her... Or not? Nope. What can we give her? We can give her seeds. Can we no. She doesn't want the poop. So give her the hammer. No. No. We could try giving her the flagstone. No, pregnant women shouldn't carry heavy things. Why wow. did he say that it can't, she can then? Chivalrous. Here, for you. Thank you. I didn't want that. Uh, I can't remember. Oh, seeds. I don't know what yeah. good it would do to give her the yeah. stuff. I'm wondering if maybe we have to go back to toward Tortuga, and because the pirate might let her in. Okay. What's in her inventory? Out of curiosity, aside from the hammer and seeds. Oh, she's got this perk of life, which can probably <gasps> oh, be used light. as light. Nope. Maybe go further. How can the spark of life? Even my elf, I don't dare. Shh, shh, shh. Put it on her. Oh my god, game. All right, we'll put on your pirate head, but. All right, put on the disguise. All right. <laughs> Do we have? Maybe, maybe the light will work now. Maybe I can hammer myself to death and no, end, end the game. No, there's a baby in there. Don't do that. Stop it. <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask you to stop, sir. So you want to go back to Tor Tortuga? I want to go back to Tortuga. See, we look so much better now with all of our outfits on. Mm -hmm. uh, he keeps taking us off. Yeah, because he's vain. Cast off! It's oh. not safe for you on the island. Van Buren could return. In that case, it won't be safe for you either. Yes, but it's not just about yourself now. <laughs> Oh well, okay. Oh, call if you need me. Okay, so she can't I go. Will. So doesn't make any difference. Well, let's let's see, because it had a, a scene. How are you doing, buddy? Not only is she blessed with an appetite, okay. she's also got fantastic. <laughs> Just look at that. Thinks he's something special. Just because he beat up a fully grown man. <laughs> <laughs> he's got the key. But I don't want to get into a fight with him. He's got the key. Okay. Just look at that. A quite fierce, grim looking ape is preventing that. Okay, how about the oracle? If not, I'll I'll figure something out. Mm. Do you want me to move your mirror yet? Or you good? Perhaps you could help me again? Shush! This is a really good bit. My brain's not working at all today. Throw poop at him. Oh no. Powder him. Give him a hat. No, I have to put it on. You want some seed? He wants some seed. <laughs> Sounds like a drug. He wants some seed, bruh.
What? Throw the lever? Where do you get the lever? Says throw the lever in the hole. We don't have a lever. Or is that the plank? Well, we already tried to do that, and they wouldn't do it. So go back to uh, Ips, uh, Lorem Ipsum and try and, try and throw the the plank yeah, into there. Yeah, and if that doesn't work, there's another thing we can try underneath the door. Like, I don't think we have any other levers. All right, hop on, buddy. <laughs> can't believe he's got, can't believe he's got to use this every time. Pick time. him up every time. Okay. The plank isn't long enough to bridge the pit. Yeah, but do you and I don't want to put it in on an angle. The beetles might crawl out. Oh, the beetles. Okay. Um. So, beat critter. Go under the door. Does it need anything in his inventory? I don't think so. It says to run in the wheel. We already did that. But then, um, we need to exit out. So have him run and then feed Nate. There we go. There's oh. light in there. There's a bunch of scarab beetles. Okay, now we gotta look at some stuff. What the devil? <laughs> oh, scarabs. Spoopy. We often use them in traps. They eat the flesh of the bones of any intruders. Fantastic animals. Yeah, fantastic. Scared me in the mummy movies. Oh, yeah. Oh, I hated those things. I won't set a foot in the room with those dung beetles scurrying around. Ah, that's what we need the dung that for. That strikes me as a uh, very good idea. All right, it's all coming At together. Least Are scarab beetles and dung beetles the same on thing? Your shoulders? I didn't think so. Oh no. That kind of worries me. Why can't I look at this? Nate. What are you... Nate. What are you doing? Nate, mate. Okay, nope. apparently he has to look from... He, he's, like, walking somewhere to look at it. <laughs> Thanks to Critter, I can see enough. And what I can see, I don't I like. You to come out here to see that. Apparently you can see through the wall. Okay, no. can you... Oh, I was gonna say. Oh, I can't look at it anymore anyway. Okay. Dung time. Here you go. Um... Perhaps a little bit. Okay. <laughs> they seem to really like great. it. Uh, that was so And cute. now? Um, do we throw... Is there any way to lure them off? Or chase them away? Are they scared of fire? Those are elite beetles. We train their great, 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 etc., etc., fathers to attack intruders and kill them in the most painful way possible. Did you know that dung beetles are very strong? Each one of them can move a dung ball weighing up to 20 times their own weight. Fun fact. Like that boulder over there? Ah. Smear. Move your ass now. <laughs> you gotta do a little dance to get into position. <laughs> Give him a minute. <laughs> mm -mm, delicious. At least I don't have to carry it around with me anymore. Oh my goodness. The so dung beetles I hope smell these the uh, people never make Very another excited. video game ever. They're running ever back again. And forth I hope on the walls of the now hole. scrubbing for toilets to get to the ball. somewhere. <laughs> Uh, do you want to give them a, a pass up? Uh, Run, my little workers! Go <laughs> forth and get yourselves the mother of all dung balls! 
man. I think it could be a little bit yeah, harder. strong. Oh, they just had uh, it roll right on top of them. Oh. So clever. They're all dead now. Not very clever. <laughs> they were very excited about the beer. Well, oh, look at that. We got the. Oh, there's something in there. Enter the room. All right, then. What happens here? Death. All kinds of horrible, nasty, painful death. Yeah, so they did actually have it roll over yeah. top of them. They're all dead now. Yeah. What was that? Okay. I'm just going to walk across <laughs> the obvious board full of small trap. Stone discs. Looks a bit like a board game. A board Behind game? I love boards, board games. We used to hide treasures. Back in the day. You like games, that right? Things are safe of sorts? Yeah. Indeed. If you manage to move the figure to one of the treasure fields, the board will flip open. There are pitfalls. And fields that turn into pitfalls after they have been stepped on. You can't step on spiky fields, but the golem can. He will move towards your figure. If you are standing in a straight line to him. Okay. Um, all right. And anyone can open the safe if he wins the game? Well, some think that a thief that goes through the trouble of solving the puzzle has earned the right to do some looting. <laughs> Personally, I never agreed with that. Okay. Loot? And by the way, we're, we've already stepped on at least two. <laughs> the game hasn't started yet. A grate and some Few kind more. of enclosure behind it. <laughs> That's fine. It doesn't look it's as if there's active. much danger lying in wait for me. There are only a couple of skeletons on the floor. Oh. What has happened to the basilisks? I'm no zoologist, but it might be problematic if you don't feed basilisks <laughs> for a few thousand years. <laughs> but the scarabs survived. Because they ate the basilisk. Yeah, but that's because there's enough shit in this world. <laughs> <laughs> like this video game. <laughs> They're literally the feeding wall. off of it. Judging oh, by its boy. position, I'd say it opens the grate next to it. Quite right. We had blind slaves who cared for the basilisks. They were only allowed to open the enclosures when all others had left the room. Why blind specifically? I don't know. So I can't see the basilisks? The basilisks don't need the wheel anymore. Oop. I have a wheel. Put that off there. Push the lever to the side, yeah. Hmm, something happened. And now it's been reversed again. <laughs> okay. Alrighty then, I'll try my luck. No, this present does not belong to you. Hush, more Present? Read, fool. Present of the Pharaoh to his favorite concubine, Star of the East. Wow. Wow. That sounds like gold, gems, finest jewelry. Huck, neg. Huck, neg. What are you doing? I will continue to make this noise as long as you try to steal from the pharaoh's favorite concubine. She must have been dead for thousands of years. Huck, Nick. Okay, okay. <laughs> All right, but Ivo has no such uh, limitations. <laughs> we'll just walk out of this room and uh, walk, and then Ivo can play the game. Walk further. Nice. See, now you can't see nothing. Huck Nag! <laughs> but like his alarm sounds. <laughs> Huck Nag doesn't like puzzles much. Too much thinking for him. Does that remind me? Whatever you? this was here, he appears me. to have I'm a it. dummy. <laughs> You're not a dummy. You just don't like puzzles very much. Yeah, it's a I'm big stupid. stone board filled with loads of small stone boards. No idea what this is for. It's for fun. There are bones lying on the floor behind the bars. 
I'd say they were of medium-sized snakes, or lizard-like creatures. At a time when most other humans were still living in mud huts, they were creating very delicate stonework here. Impressive. <laughs> of course, we elves were already living in multi-story houses, had 60 strong orchestras and comprehensive health cover. Mm. But for humans, not bad. <laughs> comprehensive health care, but they don't get sick or grow old. Eh, that's why Details. it's comprehensive. <laughs> Okay, oh, so, so she, she's gonna hold it. She's gonna hold it. Um, Nate, do you wanna go across the way? Across what way? Where? Over here? Yeah. Look at the gate. Maybe with Critter holding the thing and her holding the lever. Let me guess. The Pharaoh's burial chamber is behind this door. Yes, it is. How do you open it? You have to. Um. Have you given it a good tug yet? Okay. <laughs> I guess you need to turn this disc to open the door. With the wheel. One of the stone pins is out, just the second one to go. Okay. I guess you need to one of the stone Nope. No. Uh crap, uh, do we need the hammer? How do it? Do we need Ivo's hammer? <laughs> sure. Um, just, yeah, just switch to her. Give him a sec. He's gotta get back into his spot. He's gotta get close for us to give him the hammer anyway. Alright, yeah, she has the hammer, so... Might as well walk out of here, because you can't actually reach him. Still can't see him. <laughs> there he is. Would you like a hammer? Hey, <laughs> She's still wearing like the <laughs> googly eyes. Thank you. Perfect. <laughs> okay, now switch to Nate. Uh, doesn't she have to go back and hold the damn door? We, we don't know if she does yet. So. Right. Let's have him hammer it. It's hammer time. No, can't. Really? Huh. Oh. Uh, Hmm. Can sh uh, switch to her and have her go look at it. Yuckneg! 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 A heavy stone door locked with a sophisticated mechanism. I see. I think both stone pegs will need to be pulled back for the stone plate locking the door to turn. Okay, okay, great. Could you do that? A heavy stone. I. Th okay, so. Oh, I see. The lever she pulls. Yeah. Is one oh, of the Oh, does pegs. one of them. And so the other one must be where Critter is. So she's going to be left in the dark. Okay. She's brave. I think. Good jump, girl. At least she knows there's no scare. I think it's, I think it's really funny that they now jump over this when they could were, were they, when they were just going around. People. Oh, we can get the chisel back now that we don't need to go around. Oh, oh, maybe that's the other peg. Oh, maybe. Why not? <laughs> Why not? You right. know. Boy didn't have to put much effort into doing that. Nope. That doesn't work either. Was that for the grate? Mm -hmm. I thought I saw something when you hovered over the grate with the chisel. Great. Oh, okay, no. It was all my imagination. Okay. Um. Right here. I mean, there's nothing in here for him to. Oh, there it is. But he's gonna get. Uh, he can't. He can't do this because of this. How do we turn that? Maybe it's off now that she's holding the lever. Oh. oh, I thought he couldn't get through. Go. Over there. Go do it. He's just looking Text at it. Extra push! Yeah, extra push. Go push. Oh. Hmm. 
Mm, okay, so that didn't. Um, I assume the other lever is that, like that hole. It looks like it. Yeah, I mean the one to like stop the balls from. This. Yeah. I mean we don't have anything to put in there right now. Hmm. Chisel. Yeah, we could maybe go outside and get the chisel. I'll look ahead just in case. Okay. Wait, wait, Nate. <laughs> wait, wait, Nate. Sweet Nate. Take this. Hmm. Apparently we need to give Critter the hand wheel? No. Hand wheel, eh? Yeah. I have no idea if I need to... Who needs to have the chisel? Thank you. Here. You I might still don't know what this, like, me. throw the lever in the Ooh. hole thing is. <laughs> I keep seeing it. I'm like, there's no lever. I don't know what you're talking about. There's no lever. <laughs> Okay. Apparently that goes in there. Perfect. I can and... open the thing the rest of the way. <laughs> now that's the kind of enthusiasm you love to see. Alright, Ivo, hang tight. Gotta help my boy. Now he might be able to actually open chisel this. this. Nope. Uh, maybe I have to look at it first? Hmm, is this another sarcophagus or something? No! That is a tool chest! Perfect! Quite a lot of work just for storing some tools, don't you think? <laughs> Lordum Ipsum was built with knowledge and these tools! We revere them! We built this city with knowledge and tools. No, Nate, that is the wrong way to open the chest. Do you know how to open the chest? You have to set the right code. It is yellow, red, red, blue, green. Okay. You remember it? Why wouldn't I? <laughs> no reason. Sweet. Hmm. Various hammers, a compass, a plumb line. Not very impressive. What's this? That's just a standard time manipulator. You'd be better off taking the plumb line. <laughs> time manipulator? It stops time for a few seconds in a limited area. Very handy if you need to carry out work on fast moving parts. But the plumb line will allow you to build things perfectly <laughs> perpendicular to the ground. <laughs> That's like magic. <laughs> Magic? I think I'll stick with the time manipulator thingy. Yeah. <laughs> but, but the plums. My plums. Touch my People plums. People found the petrified Touch my bones plums. of huge ancient lizards. <laughs> no one's gonna get If that. all animals were bigger back then than they are today, this here could have belonged to a massive hamster. <laughs> it could have. Or oh, they had a pet critter. People found the petrified bones of huge ancient lizards. If all animals were bigger back then than they are today, this here could have belonged to a massive hamster. Okay. He's just stuck People on found the, if all that the hamster. Conspicuous looking holes in the wall. Yes. yes. There's some kind of lever back there. It's probably important. Yes. yes. Nice. That was a good move. When you move closer to the lever, little balls shoot out of the holes. Too quickly to really see them. They are spiky balls dipped in poison. That seems excessive. Spiky balls dipped in poison? <laughs> spiky <laughs> balls <laughs> dipped in poison? Uh, so you need to use the time manipulator on this? Yeah. That could work. 
I wonder whether I could just pluck the darn prickly things out of the air. Only if you're not too bothered about the poison they've been dipped in. Perhaps I can snake my way through. I could go here, then there. Aren't they, yeah, aren't they going uh, to start going You'd have to be again? a contortionist to get through the balls without touching one. Luckily, we know one. Hey, Critter, let's give you the time thing. Stop time for Critter. <laughs> oh no! Uh, nothing. Were you going to just like stop time on Critter? We have to do one of those things where it's like stop time, tri switch to Critter, and go. Okay. I'm too big and not supple enough to snake through the balls. Yes. So give Critter. I'm too big and not supple enough to snake. Supple. Oh, finally. He was just going to mess with him first. Here, Are take you... the time I'm just going to climb into these boxes there. <laughs> Be careful, and don't point it at anyone. Point it at Nate. Got it. Okay, no. Critter is good. He's a good boy. Hey! Oh. Critter does it himself! Oh. Critter, you're such a good boy. All right, Nate. Out you go. Teamwork makes the dream Get work. Get out of there. <laughs> go. Make the dream work. Thank goodness we had Ivo. Yeah. This is a three person job. And a mummy. Okay. Do we just open it now? Enter the tomb. The burial chamber of Pharaoh Tut Tut. Yes, that's him. Did you ever see such an ugly fellow? So that's probably the Book of the Dead. Looks like it. Let's grab it and get out of here. Ah. No. I knew that was gonna no. happen. Oh, sure. I am. Just wanted a peek. I say, this is impressive. I don't remember us having anything like this. You built me, oh venerable Tut Tut. I knew it was him. <laughs> yeah, like the guy we're carrying around's gotta be the the Pharaoh. Venerable Tut Tut? Venerable Tut Tut? Yes. <laughs> yes. You are Pharaoh Tut Tut? It would appear so. <laughs> hey, you. I say, help me get off this camel. <laughs> Ow. Ah. King Tut is back. <laughs> Hooray. Ah. In any case, I guess it's okay if we take the Book of the Dead now. Absolutely not. Where did you get that idea, mortal? I didn't get to be God King of the Desert by giving my things away. That much is clear. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> that will be for next time. That was a great way to end it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, we got we got bamboozled into being into getting him there. By tut tut. Tut tut. Tut 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 everyone. <laughs> tut tut. <laughs>